And that was the moment I realized that I was seriously tripping. I know this girl, she's on her second baby. Thanks for coming to my TED Talk. I am so tired and bored and I don't know. I'm so... You guys, Caitlin's like Grace. You sound so fake in all of your videos. I'm like, okay, well, I guess I'll just talk the way I normally talk. But I feel like that's boring. Like, am I boring? I don't know. I'm just, you guys, I'm, let me just tell you about my day. So, this morning I woke up. And I thought I was like, I thought I was awake, you know, I was in a dream. And I thought I was awake. But I wasn't. So, Anastasia was going back to school today. And um, I told her last night after we talked that I would go run over to her house so that I could say bye to her at like 6 in the morning. And I was, by the time I went to sleep, it was like 1 in the morning. So, you know, crazy, right? So, wait, what is that? I don't know. Is that my arm? Oh, that's my finger. <laughs> So I was like, okay, I'll go over. And she texts me at like 6.30. Right, but before that, I'd set my alarm for like 5, 5.30 because I actually had some work to do. And she, in my dream, I was like, I was up. She texted me and she was like, hey, you want to come over and help me like put everything up? And I was like, you know what? Sure. And I guess, like, I, like, got permission to go out at 5 in the morning over, and Anastasia lives, like, three houses down. It's not that big a deal. But I was like, okay, sure. So everything was, like, good and jolly. And in my dream, I was on her bed, and we were, like, getting ready to bring things down to the car. Right? And all of a sudden, I hear a buzz. And at this point, I'm like semi-conscious. I don't know, I don't really, I'm not really sure what's going on, but I'm between dream world and real world. And I open my eyes and I look at the text that I get from An the real Anastasia. And she's like, are you up? And I text back, yeah, like still semi con not even fully conscious. And then I close my eyes again. And in my dream, I'm like, why did you just text me? You know, she's like, and I didn't text you. And Anastasia texted me again and was like, I'm packing up my stuff to go. And I was like, okay. So I was going to go over in a sec. And like, that's what I thought in my mind. I would be like, okay. But I was still in like half my dream. And I was like, what's going on? And that was the moment I realized that I was seriously tripping and that I needed to wake up, which was crazy. Like, I don't know. You guys, get enough sleep. It's so important. Do you see me? Like, I'm basically sleeping right now. Like, I'm, I, today I'm just so tired. <laughs> guys, do you really think I'm fake? I don't think I'm fake. I mean, I may be fake to certain people. I don't think I sound fake. Oh, my camera's right here. Sorry. I don't think I sound... I feel like you guys think my videos are boring. Which, obviously, my videos aren't for, like, you guys. Like, if you guys like my videos, subscribe and whatever and like it or whatever. But if you don't, I'm not saying, like, leave a dislike button. But you don't have to watch my videos, you know? I don't know. I feel like this came to me last night, Anastasia and I were talking about it, like, I'm almost like, it's like I'm behind, but like, cause there are people in our grade that are like married or like people in my age that are like married already or like having kids already. Like I know this girl, she's on her second baby and she's only a year older than me and like, and I'm seeing like all my friends get engaged. I'm like, what is going on? When did we grow up like that? You guys aren't even out of college yet. Maybe it's like, maybe you guys, like your high school isn't like that. Or your high school wasn't like that. But, I don't know. Well, I feel like everyone's growing up so fast. Like, unnecessarily fast. Like, your 20s is where you're like, 
busting your butt to get places, you know? And now everyone's already like settling down. I always thought I would get married when I'm like 27 or something. But I don't know, like I guess at the rate everyone else is going, who knows what's gonna happen. I still feel like I'm gonna get married between like 27 and 33. And the reason I say 33 is because like, I think past the age of 36, there's like the risk of your child developing like strange stuff i don't want to say what it is like i can't remember right now guys i'm so tired and 27 because like that was like my prime time to get married in like my timeline when i was a kid 27 was the age because at that point that's actually when my mom got married because so she got married at 27 had me at 30 and then so on Caitlin at 32, Josephine at 34, and Annalise at 36, like, right before she turned 36. And so, I don't I feel like because you get, like, you're at 27, so your prime time to hang out with your significant other, and you get to travel and whatnot, because traveling with kids is such a struggle like I don't even remember traveling as a child like with the kids as babies but I do remember all the other past years were like toddler and up and it is it is a struggle especially if you're like going like on international trips oh my goodness but that's the reason why I said those ages sorry I'm like tripping guys like I don't anyways Thanks for coming to my TED Talk. If you guys would like to hear me speak about anything of importance or anything interesting to you, leave a comment down below. Not many people comment on my pictures or my, or my what is it, on my videos. So I'll definitely see your comment. Stay tuned for the next one, guys.